Happy Thursday, folks. It's that time. Grapple Pro is on the air. Big Sean Kramer's wheels with a Z. With a Z, baby. Don't forget it. And we got Flux here, and he's, he's smoking. I don't know what that means. Oh, I know what that means. That means it's time for Bud Good, my friend. Oh, man. Up in smoke from the Mile High City. Bud Good. Absolutely. Here with Flux still chasing that first win here at Grapple Pro. And... You know, aligning yourself with a guy like Bud Good will certainly go a long way in that process. I mean, it should, right? I mean, if you can't get it done by yourself, turn to a guy who's been successful inside that squared circle. And there he is. Wait just a minute. That's Mikey Everknight. That's Steve Gage. And they've said in recent weeks, Wheels, they said the, the oh, fun is over. Right there. You heard what Mikey just said. No more fun. And it's funny I mentioned that right when he starts running it out of his mouth. But no more fun for Steve Gage and Mikey every day. Basically what that means is that means trouble for any of their opponents. Because pound for pound, I've said it a million times, and I'll say it again. Steve Gage may be the strongest and toughest athlete Grapple Pro has ever produced. And with the tutelage and the team of him and Mikey every day, this is a force that I don't know that many teams around Grapple Pro can reckon with. We're talking about bringing some of the best of the best together here, dude. Absolutely. Couldn't have said it better myself. Got two grizzled bats there against, well, Bud Good is a vet. And, uh, you know, Flux was just kind of floundering there, looking to get a victory, picking up all the knowledge he can from all the vets in the back. And uh, he just doesn't seem to be able to string it together and get that W. We'll get it tonight, Kramers. Tonight could be the night he teams with Bud Good. The bell has sounded. We are underway, and I'm certainly hoping that Flux can get that victory because as you saw the last time we saw Flux in action here on Grapple Pro, he's looking towards the end of bottles now, and that's something you never want to see out of somebody, especially an athlete. Hard times, man, hard times. People deal with things in the hard times. All different. Referee Karen to call it down the middle tonight here, Thursday night, 7.30 Eastern Standard Time. Want to thank our sponsors, Carbone's Pizza. Yum. Great pizza, great chicken wings. Asking for the breadsticks. Amazing. And tell them we sent you too. And also want to send a shout out to our, our sponsor, our presenting sponsor, that is, Jose Panapinto Attorneys at Law. If you're hurt at work or you're in a personal injury situation, get the justice you deserve by contacting the good folks at Jose Panapinto. And make sure you tell them Grapple Pro sent you. And Mikey every night's got them on speed dial, as you can see, as he's the hair pull that didn't occur. Oh, stop it. I've seen it occur. He's trying to tell Karen. You better watch the hair pulling here. the same match. He didn't touch his hair. You're out of your mind, just like Mikey. You got to watch Bud Good. He has some underhand tactics he uses in that square circle. Please I've stop. seen it done before. But right now, Bud Good in control of Mikey Everyone's got him down on the canvas, and that's a lot of pressure on that clavicle and that shoulder joint. And that is a position Mikey does not want to be in for long. A Bud Good looking to exacerbate the situation. Just in that arm one more time, and in comes Fox. Fox right to it, staying right on that arm and shoulder, doing the right thing. I don't know. I got a funny feeling about this contest. I think tonight maybe Fox is night wins. Put money down on the uh, old bookie here for the match. I still owe you about 10 coffees. I'm not betting you anymore. Yeah, you're in no position to put it back yeah, down. You're being a better man out of my life. Fully. But right now, Flox, up and over he goes. Back to the arm. Yeah, doing a great job of stretching that arm and shoulder out, taking away half of Mikey every night's offense. The frequent tags, definitely keeping the fresh man in. And again, it is Bud Good. Kick to the midsection by Bud Good. Right back to the arm, like I said, of Mikey every night in the center of the squared circle. Yep, and Bud Good doing exactly what he's got to do to continue this position of dominance in this contest. But Mikey Everman, you can start to see it wearing on him. He's got to break free as soon as possible. We may see a shoulder separation or something along those lines. Irish whip there by Everman, reversed by Good into the corner. Hard, but a boot right under the chin. Oh, and now Mikey trying to get back in this thing. Face palm plant. 
right there to Bud Good, crashing into the canvas. With the man from the Mile High City. With a 42. I think I've seen some smoke come out of his ears. It was so hard to get thrown down. Well, it doesn't take authority to make smoke come out of Bud Good's ears. You and me both know this. Picture perfect tag there by Mike Everman. And now in the contest for the first time is Steve Gage. And like I said, pound for pound, potentially the strongest individual at Grapple Pro. Man, what a boot right to the center of the chest. Going right for the pin. Definitely doing damage to Bud Good's sternum. Shots like that are what lead to broken sternum. Is Bud Good in a bad way on the canvas now? now Steve Gage looking to take advantage and add to the pain as he taunts Bud Good a little bit. Bud wants that tag. He's got like three quarters of a ring to go, Lewis. These shots are certainly ending any hope of that. That's a choke. Oh, he's got the five. That's a blatant choke. Bud Good in a world of hurt. Oh, wait man, a minute. Man, have the tables have turned. He certainly have it. Steve Gage right now looking for a camel clutch, but unable to get it. Bud Good gets to the ropes just in the nick of time, but only to be choked. All the way to Gage on that neck of Bud Good and that steel cable. No more fun. Oh, Steve Gage removes the fun from every situation as we're witnessing firsthand here this Thursday night on Grapple Pro. And remember, the best in wrestling is right here in Grapple Pro, and you can watch it each and every Thursday night at 7.30 and also Monday nights. 7.30 still. Monday night's Gator Roll. Catch Grapple Pro before Monday night football. Yep. Get yourself a little bit of a wrestling fix before you get into the football or before you check out other things. Oh, here never. we go, here we go. Only good for two, and as I was saying, you will never leave disappointed when you tune into a Grapple Pro broadcast. We guarantee it. What, right now, Bud Good needs a guaranteed tag or else he's gonna be in a bad way. Much worse than he is at this particular moment. Call it another forearm shiver from Steve Gage. Into the corner again, and once again, keeping the ring cut off for Bud Good. And that disrespect is only going to get you so far with it. Gage was just telling Fox that he's number one, clearly. You Wait see a minute. It. Up to the top rope is Mikey every night. Shot Damn. right to the skull of Bud Good, and Steve still got him up and down. Oh, Stop right to the face by Mikey every night. And a quick cover. That'd be good for two. And you can see that look on every night's face. He cannot believe Bud Good got a shoulder up, but it's going to take a lot more to put down a guy like Bud Good. Mark my words. Lucky every night really taking his time, inflicting the pain on Bud Good. Inflicting the pain, and as he promised, removing the fun from the atmosphere. Right back to the pin. Just two. Still life left in the man from the Mile High City. You think Bud Good's feeling any of this pain right now? What is Mikey every night doing? Chopping away at the back of Bud Good. Right between those shoulder blades too. And that hurts. You can just see a change in Bud Good's skin every time every night makes contact with that arm. That ball. No, oh, he's in a bad way. Mikey's in a bad way here. Just two. Bud Good had that small package locked in deep like he ever barely got a shoulder. Ball into the corner, and that's a tag. And then the contest comes to the edge. Bud Good's got to get a tag. Yeah, absolutely. Right hand delivered, beautiful jab delivered by Bud Good. Got a big time opportunity there. Oh, there it is. An atomic drop, all it up. That's a Manhattan drop. Every night Gage are going to be singing a lot higher in the shower tonight. Oh, and a shot to the back from Steve Gage. Oh, and down he goes. And Jaguri landed right on the button by Lanky every night. Rolled the half to Steve Gage. Only good for two, though. And you can see that Mikey Everett and Steve Gage have been together a very long time and have a lot of history together. They know how to take advantage of the double team. They know how to take full advantage of that five seconds. And you can see what this has led to. Bud Good reaching with for his life, but unable to make the tag as the assault continues here in the center of the squared circle. Bud Good a fingertip away from tagging in his partner and getting some relief here, but not fingertip may as well have been as good as a mile. Oh, and look at this power of Steve Gage. Bud Good is not a small man. A 
up a good save. No way. Dropping those elbows. Trying to get out. Dead lifting. But good up like that. With ease, too. He's a 230 pound man. Oh, big time uppercut by Steve Gage. Right to oh, Bud Good. Oh, and a shot right to the chest. And here comes Mikey every night once again. Every night, dropping the knee. Direct impact on the temple. That time on the shoulder. Mikey every night. He's feeling it. He's Absolutely. feeling it. Starting to heat up right now. This time, moving to the sternum. Still just two. But Wheels, I don't know how long it will continue to be just two unless Bud Good gets to that corner and gets flux in this contest. Every night, once again. Smash the throat every night, says this thing is over. Up to that top rope, potentially. Let's see. Mikey, every night, gonna fly. Oh, no, buddy, home on that Alabama jam attempt. Mikey every night landed directly on his tailbone, but Bud Good needs to get that tag unable to move. This is a crucial moment in the contest, Wheels. Sure is Mikey in excruciating pain there. Damage to the tailbone and potentially to the hips. He's just got to roll over. Come on, Bud. So close to Flux. Mikey every night getting close to Gage, too. Can't get himself up. There it is. Tag into Flux. Swing and a miss by Gage. Off the ropes goes Flux. Shot to Gage. Flux yeah. lining it up again, once again. He's gotta take more than that to put Gage down. Off the ropes. Oh man! Massive spear delivered by Steve Gage. Hook of the leg. Two and three. That's it. The lows for Flux continue. What a big spear by Steve Gage wheels. Yeah, absolutely. I seen the fun get right out of the soul of Flux there. Amazing. Watch the fun get taken right out of Flux here. Oh man, this is something to remember. Bam! If you ever needed a visual representation of fun leaving a room or a body, there it is, courtesy of Genesis Gaming and Hobby. What a week of action wheels. Absolutely. No more fun, Kramers. The fun is over. I am Wheels with a Z. That is the big chrome dome right next to me. Big Sean Kramers. We will catch you Monday night, 7.30 Eastern Standard Time. And that's when the fun starts. No more fun. Well, that's what she said.